Hey curls, how you doing? I found a dupe, y'all. I found some dupes. Mm. Hey. I found a dupe. 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 Hold up. Bloop. Hi guys, welcome back for another video. And hold on, let me get a sip. We're going into the holidays, okay? So I know you're gonna want to put some money on the side. I want to show y'all some dupes to this. Y'all been asking me. Here we go. In today's video, we are going to talk about dupes for the Diva Curl Super Stretch Coconut Cream Elongator. That's a long name. Yes, we are going to talk about dupes today and some alternatives. So if you're interested in what I'm going to show y'all, then keep watching. Last time, I talked about another Diva Curl product. It was their Decadence Leave-In. And when it touched these tresses, I immediately went to that place of cheaper, less expensive quality hair products and I found a dupe for you guys. So I actually found some dupes for this and I also found alternatives. Some of you are glycerin sensitive, some are coconut sensitive, so I want to give you some dupes. Okay, so the first one I want to talk about and I don't have these because they are glycerin, they contain glycerin, and they just didn't work for my hair. However, it to me functions and works the same way. It's a creamy styler, both of these that I'm going to talk about, but they are super inexpensive. They're a fraction of the cost, maybe even one fourth of this because this retails, I forgot to tell y'all, this is eight ounces and it retails for $30. Yes, you can find this at Ulta and you can find this at Sephora. It's a great product. For you guys that love, love glycerin, I'm telling you, this is a great product. But, and it gave me amazing first day hair. Okay, it gave me first day hair. If you check out me on Instagram, I on my Instagram stories, I did actually a hair, to, uh, a makeup tutorial. And my hair in that video, I deleted the footage by accident. And that video actually was my first day hair of the Diva Curl Stretch Cream amazing first day hair like slay the day on first hair first day hair this is a creamy styler this is what you would do your twist outs your wash and goes your braid outs this is the bomb for first day hair for me i did do a review in the days in my life of this hair it was supposed to be a week in the life of my hair but it was cut short because this started acting up on me but in the spring and summer this would work for me going into the fall and cold months and no way jose so you can go into my full review if you want to check it out and see how my hair looked. You can also look at the video of the week in the life of my hair, the days in the life of my hair, and you can check out and you can actually see. I show my hair on a daily basis in that vlog. And let me know what you guys think about hair vlogs. I think I want to do that. Um, I want to do a review and then show you guys on a daily basis just to break it down. But Let's get to these dupes, okay? So the first dupe that I have for you guys, and I don't have it here, is the Cantu Coconut Curling Cream. As soon as I put this on, it immediately took me to that product. It was one of the first ones when I was going natural. That was one of the first products that I tried, and I really liked it on first day hair. Same thing. Second day hair, kaput. Third day hair, did not work, but it immediately made me think of this now if you want to try this but if you want to see how it would react to your hair without getting this i highly recommend number one i don't even know if sephora would give samples of this even enough for your hair but i highly recommend you guys trying out the cantu coconut curling cream if it works for you then this will probably work for you to me they're very similar in the hair and it's a fraction of the cost i want to say it's like 5.99 between 5.99 7.99 you can find it at walmart you can find it at drugstores and uh, i believe i've even seen it at walgreens check it out let me know what you think down below. If that's a product that you love, then that will probably be, this will probably be a product that you love. So the next one I want to talk about is the Eden Body Works Coconut Defining Cream. That one I did a full review on along with some other Eden Body Works products. I will link it down below or in the cards to the left, your right, and... I really like that. It was great on first day. If you are glycerin sensitive, these will probably work the first day. Your hair is going to be voluminous. It's going to look good. That second day, third day, it's going to start drying out really crazy because of the glycerin. And that one I want to say has glycerin in it 
two and that's why the reason why it didn't that was the reason why it didn't work for me if it does have glycerin i still don't know maybe it's another humectant in there but they are very very similar and when i say similar not necessarily in ingredients but these are more in performance i got first day hair amazing on those but I, again i want to say that those had glycerin in it don't call me if i'm wrong it is like the similar consistency on all, both of those two and that one ran, runs you between, again, $5 to $7.99, $5.99 to $7.99. It's a great product. It just didn't work for me for year-round. And I'm just in that place where I want year-round products. But if you are okay with seasonal products, then that may work for you. This is just, I'm talking about the experience that I've had with my hair. And again, take these as a grain of salt, you guys. These are only my opinions to help you shop for what you want not necessarily make the decision for you so yeah that uh, that's what i think about the eden body works coconut defining cream okay so let's get into some glycerin free products that i also think that are great alternatives the first one that i'm going to talk about is the she scented coconut curl defining pudding now this is a pudding if puddings to me are like jelly stylers or creamy stylers or creamy gels this one is significantly lighter which if you have fine thin hair this is something that you would want to go more towards it's creamy it's going to give you the moisturization but a pudding is a little bit more lightweight and i really like this it's glycerin free now i believe that this is discontinued but i am going to look for some alternatives on their website a lot of times they will change the name change some ingredients but it's the same thing not the same product but in like the same performance it's the same creamy styler that you would use but i really do enjoy this i'm so sad that this is discontinued but you guys i'm gonna find something that works i promise this is a glycerin free one by the way now two that are not discontinued that are still going strong are from kamaza care one has coconut infused products and another one doesn't so if you are coconut sensitive i got something for you too the first one that has coconut in it is the coconut pudding by by kamaza care that one is so good i went through that and that one is more of a coconut gel it's a pudding it's a creamy gel i love that i love it so much i just need to get through some more products but that one is an og amazing for slicking the edges for hold oh mg that one gives you some hang time too that one gave me some stretch and elongation and so that's something that i really like that kamaza care has mastered i want to say is that you get some elongation i even have this in my hair right now and it's I don't really get elongation. I get it more. I have to stretch my hair in order to do that. But Kamaza Hair is really good with that. And the one that I wanted to talk about, the other one, is the Califia Styling Pudding. I can't remember the prices of these, by the way. But again, I'm talking about performance. These are more on the high end. I will tell you that because you won't find these in the drugstore. You will probably find this in a hair boutique or on the Kamaza Care website. But I'm going to leave it down below. But the Califia Styling Pudding that one is so good and it does not contain coconut i think you would really like that one for my coconut sensitive gals you're gonna really like that one i wanted to come with some alternatives because some people are willing to pay more money for their hair products others are not but at the same time i wanted to give you some of this it gave me again amazing first day hair but these are some other alternatives that you may want to try before you even pick this up i know this is 30 dollars. that's an investment in a product thanks so much for watching you guys comment down below let me know what you would love for me to see if i could do next that's glycerin free thanks so much for watching you guys and i'll see you in the next video